Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Yep, this is Penlight. I, I don't know which part we are, we're just so far. But uh, yeah, so the last time um, we... Yeah, damn, I can speak. The last time we uh, saw what happened to the pen... Uh, to the... Not to me, was... She was just, you know, holding his pen. She wants to try, you know, something to herself if that works. And uh, looks like it. It did work, I guess. I don't know. But I think she's trying to hypnotize herself. I think that's why. But anyway, uh, let's just continue right now. So, uh, by the way, I'm not going to record much longer because um, I have other videos to work to. But don't worry. I'll make this at least like around 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Okay, I'll, I'll try my best. But anyway, let's go. The invitation barely leaves Natsumi's mouth before the door swings open and a smile at Atsuko strolls inside. Sorry for bugging in on you two. Hope I wasn't interrupting anything. N not to me size. No, mom. Me and Kyo is just talking. Yeah, about the project. All going well, I hope. Uh, good. Yeah, good. We were just going over some things, mom. Atsuko giggles. Missive. Mischievously. <laughs> Alright, but do you take a break sometime, okay? I got some snacks for the fridge. Thanks, mom. We'll be down for lunch in an hour. Aw, oh, that's so cute. Look how mom is supporting them. Wonderful. Well then, I'll leave you to it. Atsuko closes the door behind her as she leaves us be. Your mom seems nice. Nosumi smiles faintly. She is, although she can be a, a bit much sometimes. Yeah? I mean, you saw her just now. She could she could wait to get involved with us. I get why I get why she still moved her each other so much, but I'm 18 years old. I'm not a kid anymore. Oh wait, she's 18? Boys, boys. We are fine. Don't worry, she's 18. <laughs> Ishiro? I'm sure that's a name I haven't heard before. Alright, oh, he's he's my little brother. Nosumi smiles again, more brightly this time. You may have met him, actually. He's a first year at our school. Oh, huh. I don't really know what to say to that, but she's quick to move on. Anyway, Nosumi pulls her desk drawer open and takes my pen light back out of there. And then hands it to me. Thanks for letting me borrow this, but I think it's better if you had it back. I take it from her, although it feels a bit weird now after what we've been talking about before. Her mom stepped in. And there's something else I decided. What's that? I want to change rule number three. Huh? Wait, what do you mean? Wait, wait what? Rule number three. Then she means. Now that we know what your pen like can do, I don't think we should try and hypnosis at your place anymore. Then, we'll do it here instead. Huh, but aren't you worried your mom will find out about your secret? I am, but I've given this a lot of the thought. And if we're going to keep doing hypnosis together, then I have to think about my own safety. Her own safety? Oh, damn, okay. Knowing there's someone else in the house who can help if things go wrong, it is, seems like the smart thing to do. What, so you still don't trust me? Nosumi sighs unintentionally. Look, it doesn't matter if I trust you or not. We've seen what your pen line can do to me, even if you didn't mean to. We know it's dangerous, and knowing what I do know, it's made everything I've done with you so far really scary. Oh, so that means uh, the pen. So he's not a good at uh, hypnot, hip, you know, hypnotizer. Is this the pen light itself? It looks like it. It's some kind of thing he put in there. I don't know what he did, but it seems making her feel hypnotized. I don't know something. I don't know something very, very interesting. But I also won't deny it. It's giving me the best experience of hypnosis in my entire life. So what are you saying? I'm saying I want us to try doing more things with your pen light. It's dangerous, but we know to be more careful now. 
and I feel there are so many on and answer questions about it. Like, is this me who's affected by your pen line so extremely horrible? <laughs> sorry that, sorry about that. I'm kinda tired. <laughs> I would do the same of others, for others. But, but more importantly, can we use it to achieve a state of hypnosis and induce suggestion that doesn't end up hurting me or anyone? Because I really want to believe we can. But what do you think, you? You've made something amazing. Looking down on my pen line, I start to feel a little sense of pride. Do you want to find out more about it, me? Say yes. And as I look to her, I'm feeling a rush of excitement. Yeah, of course, that's what I want. We smile at each other in silence for a moment, and then they kiss together and they married. The end. <laughs> okay, I'm joking. It's been an awkward few days between us, but right now it feels like we're starting to understand each other. Okay, don't don't get uh, don't get uh, you hype. Damn, what was I about to say? How, how does that I say? I forgot the word. Um, don't be hype. Yeah, I know that's a bad English there, but whatever. Trust me, I started to wonder from the for me to the pen line now in my hands. Okay, and so first. I think it'd be a good idea to review what we do now. Do know. And not in agreement as I turn my pen light over to my hand. Sorry if I'm, you know, reading this so fast. If you guys want me to read it uh, very slowly or normally, is this, just let me know in the comments. Right, so like I said, this is an off-the-shelf medical pen light that I bought from the internet. It was a pretty cheap, which was important since I was gonna take it apart apart and maybe break it so that also means there's nothing special about the light itself i guess yeah the intense the intensity and being it are pretty st standard okay so what's special about the pattern you put on it it's a little complicated i guess i don't think it looks like anything in particular and that's why you thought it i'd catch the eye so well because it doesn't yeah, I figured I, I engage a person's natural curiosity, so they're more inclined to focus on it and uh, facilitated them going into a hypnotic state. I have no idea why that works on you as well as it does, though. Nosumi stroked her chin thoughtfully. I wonder if there could be there be a way to make it work less. Well, what do you mean? Like. Could you turn down the intensity of the beam, maybe? No, like I said, it's a basic pen line. It's a switch on and off. That's all. Hmm. What about if you put that pattern onto the different mode of the pen line? One that you can access or has a weak, weaker beam to start with? I let out a little groan. I could try, but it'll, t it'll take ages. I'll probably have to buy it online again, so that'll be a couple days, then. I gotta take it apart and try to make it emit the same pattern as this one. Right. And then it may not even work at all. Yeah, I mean, the pattern rings gotta be important, but we don't know if it's the only reason it works this way. Maybe the light intensely and why they aren't exactly what they need to be so we can't divide. Or maybe there's something else that's special about this particular light that we don't know about. Oh my god. Damn, I can't stop yawning, sorry. Not to be nods with a sigh. Yeah, not to mention exam season is almost on the top of us, so I suppose it's asking too much of you to experiment with this stuff right now. Yeah. It will fall sound for a moment. Then, with a small shrug, Natsumi smiles encouragingly at me as she speaks up again. Okay, well, let's forget about that angle for now. If we can do anything about the light, then we need to focus on what you do with it. It's not like I even do much. I just shine in the back and throw over your eyes and do a standard induction while you watch. Okay, I I guess there's not much you can change about that either. Go a little slower, maybe. But besides that, there's 
Just what you say to hypnotize me and what you say while I'm, I'm under because you really could work on how you phrase your suggestions. And speaking of suggestions, maybe next time you could make it clear to my subconscious not to do anything that'll endanger me. Yeah, yeah, I could. And you could impress a lighter trance instead of trying to make me go deep. Maybe that that'll be safer. Honestly, when the waist is unloading on me, it sounds like she's already told this stuff through. Alright then, so how exactly do you want me to do this? I'll tell you subconscious is not to be so dumb this time and then what okay so i was thinking we could try some more memory play like if you ask me any questions suggest i'll have no idea what the answer is that would be safe and i think you could really test how effective it's been on me by asking me simple and simpler questions like what's the number between three and five no some music comes at me <laughs> yes like that it sounds like a plan, so I hold up the pen light in front of her. Alright. Oh, that we are in, posi in that position again. And in response, let me lays back on her bed. So you know what you're doing? Try to put your you in a lighter trance than before. Tell your subconscious to watch itself and say you can't answer the questions. Got it? That's me sucks in the brief to, to steal herself and then not. All right, I'm I'm ready when you are. Okay, so lighter trends than last time. I'm not totally sure how to do that when not to be so easy to hypnotize, but I guess I shouldn't impress so much about how sleepy she's getting. I'll just have to wing it. Okay, so back once again to the light, not to me. Back to back to watching those parents we talked about. Yeah, this. Calmly letting those light spots hit your eyes. Putting all your attention on the light as you feel yourself becoming more and more relaxed, more and more sleepy. Just letting your consciousness drift uh, effortlessly away as you stare, that's right. Ah, she's already dropping fast. Maybe this is as far as I need to go with the windows. And while you're in this nice relaxed state of trance, uh, consciousness fading, you'll find that your subconscious is still listening attentively to my voice. And what I want you to know is that no matter what you find suggests to you, whether now or any other time, if you feel the suggestion will cause you harm, you will ignore the suggestion and proceed as if it was never suggested in the first place. Understand, not me? I understand. Is this better than the other times we've done this? I didn't impress on her need to sleep, so her heavily glazed eyes are staring importantly ahead between slow and frankly blinking. She just looks so out of completely of it, even after only a few sweeps of the light. Well, let's carry on. Very good, Natsumi. And with that in mind, I want to suggest something else. While we're together in this room and you ask a question, you'll find you yourself instantly forgetting the answer. It doesn't matter what the question is, you always seem to find the answer that completely drops away from your uh, conscious mind. But there's no need to worry because you'll consciously remember again as soon as I leave the room, okay, not to me? Alright, oh my god, this is... Damn. That's great, it's me. You're subconsciously remembering everything I told you as you wake up on three. One, two, three. Well? I smile as she breaths and the life seems to immediately return to her eyes looking at me now and not true me as before. I can't help that watching her wake up from her trance is too cute. Oh, that is so cute. That felt nice. You did, you did what well, we agreed, right? Yeah, I tried not to take you as deep as the other times, although, although you still seemed pretty far gone to me. Oh, no, 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 that's cute. That's cute. Not me gets up from the bed and takes a deep breath while slowly running ahead through her hair. Yeah, it still f felt pretty intense to me. Do you remember anything about it? Um. What? 
I said, do you rem remember everything about the turrets? Ah, uh, not so many fronts in Todd, but can only shake her head. I don't know. Oh, haha. <laughs> Two other things just hit me. Guess it's pointless asking you that right now. Don't worry about it. Oh, right, of course. So that means the suggestion to uh, to call again? And it's so weird. I mean, I know exactly what you did, and I'm going to keep trying to res resist it. It's why are we doing this, after all? So, okay, ask me something else. I think, I think of what to ask her, and then it hits me as I look around her room again, and remind myself of the boxes uh, strewn across her floor. Alright, what's your favorite board game? It's easily... Uh, do you have one? Uh, don't confuse me with more questions. Not so me puts a hand to her. Tepa C tries to concentrate. Okay, just tell me when you've given up. Just then, there's a knock on the door. Oh? Wait, again? Guys, I'm about to get lunch started. Do we fancy some salmon sushi? Uh, I don't know. Ah, oh, damn, Natsumi said we, we'd be breaking for lunch. I forgot about that. She must have suggested it as another of her safety pre precautions, knowing that her mom was inevitably going to check on her, but... Is she ever going to leave us alone? What? Don't ask me. Huh, how's it going in there? Working hard or hardly working? Mom, I... Uh, Oh my, it sounds like you're in trouble. I'm coming in. Damn, mother's very supportive. Without further warning, Atsuko swings the door open and joyfully paces inside once more. Is everything okay, you two? I... Is it? Not to me. Helplessly looks to me in confusion. Guess I'm speaking for both of us right now. Uh, yeah, everything is fine. We're fine. It's just that I can't help not saying that you don't have any books out or anything. Oh. So... Oh. What's really going on in here? Uh-oh. Um... Oh god. Um... Where... Huh. Now this is interesting. Is she struggling to think of a story or is her post... Post-hypnotic suggestion still affecting her? Doesn't she feel in... Uh, in dan wait, damn, how do you in danger by falling near in the presence of her mother? You did say you were doing schoolwork, didn't you? I wait, wait I did, I did. Oh my god, I don't know. Crap, she really is forgetting. So, so did the little safety suggestion we gave her do anything at all? Okay, seriously, what on earth is going on? Oh god. Alright, Q, stay cool. You can help her out. I'm just gonna use the bathroom real quick. All I need to do is leave the room and Notsumi will be back to... Now hold on just a moment, mister. Huh? Oh, oh god. Um, I hate to say it, but you've both got me a little worried. No one's going anywhere until I get some answers. Please, mom, there's nothing to worry about. So what are you doing? Um, um, not me. You can tell me what's wrong. Oh, no, 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 no. She's hypnotized. Why, you idiot? Why did you to tell, tell her like that? Why won't you say, like, uh, well, damn, I also don't know what to say. <laughs> what? Kiyu! I'm sorry, that's me. I just don't know what else to tell her. Yeah, it's an act we're doing for the culture festival. I hypnotize her so she forgets the answer to any questions she's asked. Is that true, that's me? Yeah, it's a. Uh... Yeah, what's more, I know I can just say that and ex expect uh, Atsuko to believe it, especially when you're in no state to back me up. I need to hypnotize you in front of her just to prove that's all this is. Uh, I'm going to have her out, okay? That's cool. Huh? Hopefully, I will need the pen line for this. I'm sure neither of us want her asking questions about that thing. But from what I've read about him, <sighs> I can't stop yawning. 
but from what I've read about the hypnosis, I think I can pull this off without without it. I'm not gonna do a show a little confidence like I know what I'm doing. Miss me, please take a seat on the bed. She looks like she'd rather spontaneously burst into flames than endure another moment of this in front of her mom. Oh god. Oh my god, no way. No, hold on boys. I'm just, just not, you know, just, just, just taking... I need to do this. Alright, uh... Alright, there we go, I took a picture now, for the thumbnail. Nevertheless, not to meet this as I ask while her... Because her mother sits down with her. Okay, now look at me. I point to my eyes as I say that... I say this, and not to me awkwardly meets my gaze. Not knowing what else to do. Now, do you mind if I take your hand? I... I do no, just focus on me, just... Relax and focus and, and sleep. Deep asleep. Not to me. No way. Look what you did. Look what you did. Look at her. No. Oh god. While she confused herself trying to answer me, I sharply tugged down on her arm and gave her a short, snappy and easy to understand command. It is comment her, her befuddled mind was all too eager to latch onto and I have to keep the relief from showing on my face as I watched her slump back down into trance. But man, I'm so glad that worked. Very good, and now that you're back here deeply hypnotized, I need you to let go of the session I made to you. So as so as soon as you wake up, you'll be able to answer questions normally, no longer affected by any of my hypnosis today, okay? Okay. That's great, not to me. Now, making up feeling nice and refreshed on three. One, two, three. That's me. I let the flicker as she begins to wake wake what's all the well by her mother who has been con <laughs> oh my god, I voice cracked. Has been Constantly observing us the whole time. Kyoto was. Notsumi, are you okay? Notsumi is... <laughs> squeaks at the sound of her mother's voice. Another picture for the thumbnail. Just, to, just to be sure, guys. I know. Sorry. It has to be like this. If you're a YouTuber, you have to make thumbnails. <laughs> Notsumi comes. Oh, okay, guys, already stuff it. I'm fine, mom. Oh sure? Yes, I'm sure. Stop fussing. That's collapse relieved. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my. This is just like one of those silly late night shows on TV. So this school project you were talking about is an act you're putting on for the culture festival? Th th that's right. Uh time sure have changed. When I was in high school, we out. <laughs> She's like those old grandpas. The times have changed. When I was in high school, we always went win the cafe time for our culture of events. Well, this is exciting. You're really putting yourself out there, not to me. Yes, right. So, anyway, salmon sushi for lunch? Sure. Oh, cute. Satisfied, Natsumi's mom leaves us to start lunch, but as soon as she leaves, Natsumi starts holding her stomach. Hungry? Okay. Well, I have to end the video. I know, it's kind of short, yes. Like I said in the beginning, it will be like around 24, 23 minutes, 25, 22, I don't know. But yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, I really appreciate it, uh, sticking around, and uh, you know, getting... I don't know, this is getting so interesting. This is like a non-stop content, like, it, the story keeps going. So, I'm actually liking this so far. I really do hope if whatever pen lights ends, if I end pen light videos, whatever, you know, I added. I hope there's like more of these kind of styles, because this is actually very interesting. Um, and yeah, well, uh, 
yeah, I don't know what to say. Uh, make sure to uh, subscribe or give a like as well. You know, give it a thumbs up. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.